Welcome back to Tammy's Antique Vintage Stalls and More. And in the background, what you are hearing is a lawnmower. But today we're going to talk about rocking in the rocking chair. How many of us mothers took our little ones and sat in a rocking chair and rocked our babies to sleep? Well, these are little people rocking chairs. And we're going to start over here with Bye Bye Baby from 1961 by the Ideal Toy Company. And he's sitting in just a basic white rocking chair, probably from the 50s, 60s, maybe 70s. Nice little rocking chair. He's just loving it with his bare tootsie shown with his little monkey hat. And you can see how much I paid for this, this chair. I paid a whole three bucks for that, or five five dollars for that chair. Rocking chair. I got it from the Sally Ann. Then we're gonna come over here and we have Baby Bubble sitting in a wicker chair. This is not a rocking chair though, so she can't rock away, but anyways, but she can sit and look pretty. And this I got from a gentleman at work whose mother was going to throw it away and I picked it up for $5. So I thought that was a nice little chair to have for, for the dolls to sit in. Sometimes I can put two in there, depending. She sits pretty good though. Now over here at Baby uh, Dimples. And she's sitting in a hundred year old, a little over a hundred year old rocking chair. I'm going to show you the back of it. I bought this from a gentleman in Chatham here who got it from a lady who was going into an old folks home who couldn't keep all her belongings. And she wanted it to go to somebody who would look after it and he didn't know quite what but who who would come along but I came along and I told him I would I want it for an old doll that's pretty close to the same time and it's about 1910 she got it in 1920 it was a used chair her uncle gave to her and when she was born and she was born about 1925 it was used for his children so you know the old hand-me-down idea which is wonderful you know and so now I'm the proud owner of it. It's about 100, 100 maybe 110 years old, getting on to that. Wonderful, privilege to own. Over here we have another baby dimples, sitting in a rocking chair. And we'll see how much I paid for this one. I paid, well, I, I, it says 20 on the tag, but I didn't pay 20, I bid them down, I remember that. I got that from a flea market. And I paid probably about 10, I think it was $10 with, with some butter tarts. Came to about 15. Because there was a table, his table, his wife made butter tarts. And so I got butter tarts in, in a rocking chair. And, and again, it's just a nice 19, you know, uh, maybe 40, 50 rocking chair with a faded out old little doggy on the back, a little puppy. But anyways, always nice to see these old rocking chairs. They're great for holding the big babies or even a couple little babies. Now here is a carnival, Cupid doll. Great big guy. His head's chipping at the back here. He's going to go for a remake down the road. I hate to bother his face here. That's why I haven't really um, gotten into doing too much with him because I enjoy him for who and what he is. But I got him in a nice little romper here with a little koala bear. I think it is koala bear that made this here. I can't remember. Maybe not. Well, Johnson's Creations, it says. But anyways, on the back of this chair, it has a nice, I would say this is 1950s, 1960s. Look at that nice old vintage um, bunny there, and the, he, he's supposed to represent a teacher. And they're going to school in the schoolhouse, and he's got his students a little rabbit and a little duck, and off they go. They're going to go and learn something. He's got his little pointer stick there, and he's going to go teach them their alphabets. Isn't that nice? And then over here, I have another baby dimples, 27 inches, I think she is, or she's a big girl, and she's just sitting in a nice rocker. And also, this is the same story. It was going to be tossed out into the garbage, and I bought it for $5. So you see, you can buy stuff. It's not always expensive. It doesn't have to be. I, I know the, the old rocking chair I did pay $80 for. Still, I thought for a 110-plus year rocking chair, I thought it was still a good deal. Um, and you take for what you pay for each month. Look at those fat, chunky little legs. Oh, my goodness, look at that. Chunky fat legs. Look at them. Can't beat those fat chunky legs. Let's see hers. Yeah, she's got the big fat chunky legs too. Not the bear. Bear's got little knobby knees. There we go. But anyways, I thought I'd share this with you. Everybody likes to see, you know, some of these old pieces of furniture together. You know, that just, um, you know, helps bring out your dolls. Sits them up really nice and pretty. And, and gives them a, a, a real remarkable look when they're sitting in something close to their age. Not all of them are. But it's nice just to see, still see them all sitting. Like I say, they don't always have to be in high chairs or anything of that sort. But um, what a nice way to display, another way to display them. But anyways, there you go. Look at that face. 
He's looking over there at Baby Dimples. He wants to kiss her. Well, that's what I think he wants to do. What do you guys think? I'll leave that with you. I think he wants to kiss her. He's playing shy or something. But anyhow, you can't beat a Cupid doll. That look. Just beautiful. Now, I believe with him, too, there is a girl one. He has the blue feet. She has the pink feet. So down the road, I'd like to get his sister that goes with her with him, and they can pair up together. But anyways, I thought I'd give you one more a show of these and just let you see them sitting there and just having a great time on this nice summer day. I did it, I did it on Saturday. I filmed this on Saturday because I was afraid it was going to rain tomorrow, which we're calling for rain again. Getting tired of the rain. But anyways, but we need it, so I won't say too much about it. But anyways, just thought I'd show them to you. I hope you enjoyed this and have a great day and a great week. I will be back with the gesso. The gesso, I'm going to talk about that next. So stay tuned. It's coming. But I wanted to show you my rockers and my, my sitting chairs that I display my dolls in my doll room. Someday I'll, I will show you my doll room. Right now it's a disaster. Anyways, I'll get back to you. Thanks again and have a great day. Bye-bye.